Mm-hmm. I know some of the uh, issues and relationships. I mean, they they kind of like <laughs> it's so many different types of relationships, right? But I wanna I wanna ask you about this one, bro. So, what do you, what are your thoughts about? And this is probably a, a multi part question, I guess you would say. But what are your thoughts about long distance relationships? <laughs> You know, and how long of a distance is it too long? You know how some people, you know how some people say, I can't do long distance. Well, right. what's long to you? Is it like, you know, five, four or five hour drive or whatever? Or is it like a quick hour and a half flight? You're like, so what, what are your thoughts about long distance period? Well, uh, first of all, I am against long distance relationship. Oh, okay. this is surprising. No, look, look, this is family congregation. No, 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 <laughs> no. I, I, I'm for you know. Okay. I'm, I'm for long distance relationship. I have to say that. Put that on the record right hmm. there. Okay, but with long distance relationship, you got to be mature. You got to be mature about it. Okay, because. Uh, it has to be a level of trust between you and that individual. Okay. Um, okay. You have the trust. First thing, you have the first thing, no, 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 but, but the first thing, the maturity, because I mean, if you're not a mature person and you found someone that, uh, you think you might be good with, and they could be in the same town, but if you're not ready, you meet someone a week later, and then you down with them. So you have to be in the right frame of mind with yourself as a man and as a woman. Okay. And then if you want to go forth with that long distance, it doesn't matter if they four hours away or 13 hours away. Don't matter about the hour, three hour plane ride. I don't care if they're East Coast and West Coast. If y'all two are like minded, mm-hmm and really desire each other who cares about it but the probability of it working seriously is not so good Mm -hmm. unless you are together as that individual man that individual woman you can't be halfway you got to be a hundred percent in well i'm serious well well, you got to be a hundred percent in okay so you you're a hundred percent in and you're mature but yeah. how long do you do this long distance relationship? You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, like yeah, yeah, if yeah. you have somebody across country that you're dating, married, whatever, right? And you're in that relationship and then you do you, when is it, when do you come to the point where you, you know what, we need to close this gap. We need to close this gap. Meaning you need to come here or I need to go there. Something needs to happen. When do you get to that point? Or do you just cont- you just ride this wave? What do you do? Hmm. Ride this wave. Okay. Shout out to all the young people. Okay. <laughs> uh, ride the wave. I like that. But I, I will say this. When, uh, say you've been doing it for two years, okay? Traveling, you go to her spot, she comes to your spot, okay? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Something has to be done. And both of y'all have your perspective, career. Mm -hmm. Communication is going to be the biggest key factor in deciding, hey, I want you. We committed to each other. Now, let's get a deeper commitment. I want you to move down. Oh, so it's the man, right? It it has to be the man, though. The man has to make this decision. Do, Do you think that? I mean, even yes. though you even though you sit down and you talk and you say we need to talk, right? We need to talk. So you sit yes. down and you're talking, but it needs to be the man to make that decision, right? Well, look to, look to close the gap right here. I see that. I see that. Yes, he's gonna have to make the decision. Yes, but is he gonna decide to go up there with her, or she's coming down here with him? Now, before we do all of that, because I'm gonna tell you what I'm thinking. Mm-hmm. I'm not, I'm not going to just up and leave 
if we're not finna make this next step. Hey, people, family, I don't believe in living with no, for no lady. I don't believe no lady living in with no man or whatever. If we done been into this through the thick and thin and we committed, it's going to have the wedding bells. So I'm going to do it right. So, so I'm going to do it right. Oh, so okay. if we're not ready for that, that right there, then why am I coming up there with okay, you? Okay. So, so you're saying, remember, men control relationships. So mm -hmm. it's all on you to, to determine when this happens, right? Mm -hmm. To close the gap. Yes, so what? So, so it's on them. So how long do you do this? You do it until you get tired? No, 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 Kane. I, I can't give a definition. That that, oh, that don't always have to be a personal. That yeah, that's gonna be mm -hmm. what you was good for you might not be good for me. Mm -hmm. Okay, say I'm in this relationship for two years, and usually you know the lady wants to. Oh, what what are we doing? I know you committed to me. I'm committed to. You. You has been two years. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm not ready to make that commitment or whatever. Okay. I might need another two years. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't say it. You just how, whatever communication, whatever it feels right with you, only you can decide that I can't give you. And I don't think you can just say, Hey, um, in another year, we'll be together. We'll be married and we're going to make this right here. No, no, I ain't saying, no, I, no. you know, set a, a, a time limit and say, hey, at this point, I want to be there because you just don't know. But I'm saying, yeah, like, right. it, you know, so you think so you're saying long distance relationships can work. They can. But, but they come. What? So if they if they can work, if they can work out. But when does the when when do you get to that breaking point? Well, like a lot to, of times. Like when? Okay, uh, just it, the distance is a is a big factor, you know, missing a person and all of those different things, mm -hmm. you know, um, and long distance relationships and not the long distance relationship from uh, the past, you know, because you got FaceTime and I'm seeing you every night. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Talking about, we're not talking you know? about that. <laughs> yeah, that's I know, technology, technology today still, you know. It helps. It, it helps. Yeah, okay. It, but it, it's, it not, helps. it's not the same. It's not the same. We don't have that physical contact. Yes. Okay. Yes. You, cause look, back in the yeah. day, what we used to do, talk on the phone all the time, right? Yes. Yes. So I want to, now I, we're talking and seeing. Yeah. So I want to kind of slot a, a long distance relationship that I had way back in the day, right? So this particular relationship, it was with uh, um, a lady that I met way back in uh, Cuba. Cuba, you remember that's where we met, right? So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> man, you, you, were 16, you were sixteen years old. No, man. Would, how, would I, how would I be sixteen? Yeah. No, man, no. <laughs> but anyway, but anyway, yeah, I was in the relationship, and um, the relationship kind of—I mean, it was like boyfriend girlfriend. So the um, yeah, yeah. okay. relationship kind of—I I moved on. I had PCS and left, and went to yes. my next duty station. And then it was like, yeah, we met up, you know, whenever there was a time for for us to take leave and everything. But then it was like, it kind of like fizzled out. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? It kind of fizzled out because it, it, it was just too much to kind of try to hold on to something that's so far away. Now, mind you, I was in, at that time, I was in South Carolina and she was in Cuba. I mean, that's a lot of distance there. Mm -hmm. But, um, but yeah, I was like, man, this is yeah, we gotta just kinda let this go. And if it if it comes back to fruition and uh, you know, maybe we cross each other path or something like that, we just gotta let this go because this this long distance, you know, you know, it just it just wasn't working. And then, you know, that was one of the long distance. And then I mean, I have a a couple of other ones that were like when I first came in the military, because my high school sweetheart, yeah, that one, you know, <laughs> it went away. And then <laughs> who I met in 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 tech school or whatever, it went away because she went to Japan. I was in Cuba. It was like, what? Oh man, come on. So it was oh. like, like, and, and you can say maturity. I I, I give you that. Yeah, but yeah, and you know, I was young at the time, but. Still, I was like, you know, I really want, and yeah, we can talk. We make ways in talking and everything. And then as technology evolved and now we can see each other and talk or whatever, but that's all we're doing is seeing each other and talking, you know, 
besides, you know, talking on the phone. So it's like, man, I got to have you here. So I need to make a decision. I need to make a decision on if I'm going to stay in a relationship this long or do I need to come? What, what's the better benefit for, you know, how she feel about coming where I'm at or I'll go where she's at or whatever. Right. Right. You know, look at the dynamics of it. And once you look at that okay. dynamics of it, then it's like, okay, yeah, I can, I, I can work with that. But I have to do that instead of stringing it along. Right. I right. had to make that decision and that's being mature, be, make that decision. And it's like, you know what? We can't make this work. Or um, I'm going to change the game plan. We're going to change the layout because I want to be near you. So in order for me to be near you, I need to make some changes. Either I'm coming to you, you come to me. I'm 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 surprised and I'm glad that you say uh that you would uh talk and then you would go to her cuz I figure you know No 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 this, it, no no I ain't talking no, about she coming to me It depends on this. what how it benefits the whole relationship All right So Thank remember you. remember I, maybe I just left that out it depends on how it no. benefits the relationship like if I'm in um back in Little Rock and she's in I don't know um dc there's a lot mm-hmm. of more there's a lot more opportunity for me in dc than it is in little rock okay so yeah i might have a good you know job or whatever and is paying the bills yeah. but then maybe i can find something that's a little bit more lucrative in the dc area or whatever right? yeah so i can be I like remember. all right and she's there it's a win-win right yeah, yeah. or bring her to me where the job community is not very good even if it was a woman that was, you know, overseas or whatever, the job community is not very good. So why don't you come over here? What's well, a little bit better? Right. So you just right. look at that. I got you. You look at that. You know. I got you. So that I mean, that's how I look at it, man. When it comes to well, to a uh, long distance, um, you know, I just don't want to drag do, it do out. Work, I don't want to drag. Do you believe? Do you want to? Do you believe they work, Kane? Initially, initially, can. initially, but you got to mm-hmm. close that gap quickly. I feel like you got to close a gap quickly. I, I don't feel like you can just kind of, all right, let's just ride this thing and see what happens. And I, I just feel well, like. What's quickly for you? What's quickly to you? Man, I, so, I mean, especially if you're going to say that this is your, this is, this is your woman. Yes. You know, it's time for me to start looking for some opportunities or maybe she needs to start looking for opportunities that either where I'm at or, I'm, you know, that I, I just look at it like that because. And nothing's going to change either, you know, uh, I mean, you can change as far as in a job and stuff like that. You want to do that type of stuff. Right. But I just, I, I, I mean, mm. I just, I feel like you're going to just kind of fizzle out. And All that's, right. and that's, and, right. and that's just over time, you know, even though you can be mature, you can be, you can be on the phone every day. You can be whatever, however you do it. I don't know how you do it. But, um, but if you're doing that and that works for you, to do that, then by all means, continue to do so. But I'm just speaking on for me. It's like I just I want you to be kind of near me. Um, oh, okay. It's not a, it's not nothing about you know uh, infidelity or anything like that. It's nothing dealing with that. It's just more so like I just I, I want you near me. I want you near yeah. me, and that's just you know that's just my take on it. You know, I just, you want to yeah you want to be coddled and stuff. No, no, you ain't got to coddle Get me. Back to be burped. Okay. And all that. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I agree pretty much with what you're saying. Yeah. Uh, I do believe long distance relationships can work, and the time frame I, I would grow with, go with you on that. As far as uh, something has to be done, you know, to get you know, the two people uh, together, but uh, we don't know the time frame. It's on. It's on the man, though. Yeah, it's always on the man. And, uh, so I, I do believe in them before I didn't when I was younger. No, there's no way I couldn't yeah. try it. But, you know, I was always, you know, out there. Yeah. So, no, uh, but you get older, you get mature. Mm-hmm. The maturity is a big aspect. And then as long as y'all have that communication, that communication, then uh, you can grow by leaps and bounds. And then eventually you come together. So, but, so I got, uh, one, one, I got, you know, okay, you go. know, you know, devil's advocate. Here we go. Slide, and I got one question in. for you. Yeah, I'm gonna slide this okay. in. So you say maturity. Okay. So uh, if it's mature, are we talking about you know time in the game, age, 
and everything comes with, you know, maturity and things of that nature. <laughs> if, if that's the case, then if you're mature up in age, you don't, you find somebody that's worth it, then you may not want to uh, keep playing the field because you're old. You, you know what I'm saying? You're getting old now. Right. You, yeah, right, back right, in the day, right, you right. can go find somebody, but now I'm old. Right. My, my pool is a little s- smaller now. Yes, yes. You know? What you're saying is facts, yes. So so is that the reason why long, so if you're older, long long uh, relationships work better than when you're younger? Oh, no, no, no. Well, yeah, 100%. Well, I, well, I've, I've only said 100%. I said that really fast, but mm-hmm. it doesn't matter. Uh, the significance on the age is, we putting a lot on it right there. But look, when we were 20 years old, 19 years old, Long distance relationship might be because she stay across town. Come on, I don't know about it. I'm just saying. I'm just that's a joke right there. Uh, that's just a joke. Mm-hmm. Where she stay in the next town? That's long distance, man. We mm-hmm. we still running around. Yeah. When I'm talking about the maturity factor, uh, it was you have lived some your life. I'm not saying you're old, but I'm saying you just done grown. Okay, mm-hmm. whether you've been married or not, it doesn't matter. But you know what you want. You know yourself. You know that you yourself is not about playing games anymore Mm -hmm. if you did. So if you find that person that you would really like to spend some quality time with and she lives somewhere else or he lives somewhere else, Mm -hmm. it's on you to invest the time that you can in that person and have that conversation. Hey, I know we long distance. But this is how I feel about you. I don't want to play any games and I will commit myself. You know, at the time, me girlfriend, whatever, all that, mm-hmm. the, the, the titles that we put on each other. Mm-hmm. And I expect the same thing. How are we down with that? Yeah. If she's not, then you just keep on moving. That's it. I think that, I think it's too easy, especially you always say it, be straight up. Mm-hmm. If you're straight up, with yourself first and then with the partner Mm -hmm. man that's half of the battle that's more than half of the battle right there well i mean the way the way that you're speaking on it is more so you know if you're older you just don't want to deal with any uh game so you just kind of work you're gonna make it work but do you want to make it work i I got what you just said that's that's taking it that means if, if you're gonna make it work you'll make it work with some craziness that might be going on yeah. from your partner. Yeah. No, well, we don't have time for that because don't limit yourself. And what I'm saying is <coughs> don't accept BS just because of you're older. There's still somebody out there for you. Mm-hmm. Or even you're younger. You don't have to accept somebody treating you wrong or the behavior patterns that you don't like in that individual. Yeah. Don't just make it work to just make it work to say that you have an individual. No. Mm-hmm. That's ridiculous. I we done did that before. Yeah, you know. So no. Okay. All right. Oh, but let me ask you this. Let me ask All you right. this real quick, and then we can uh, shut it down. Yeah. Um, do you believe in a uh, living with a lady or whatever? Y'all not married, but y'all boyfriend girlfriend, and then hey, let's go ahead and move in. How do you feel about that? I did it. I definitely did. Oh, it. For real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I okay. definitely did it. Uh, uh, you know, when I was younger, you know, oh, okay. yeah, yeah, <laughs> but I definitely did it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I definitely did it. Um, you know, I, I didn't have any guidance, um, on that situation. Um, I know my dad did it, um, cause my dad never married or whatever, but, um, uh, yeah, yeah. I didn't have any guidance on it. So I just figured that, you know, that's what we do. So, and, and, you know, I, I guess it was okay. My experience in it, you know, I guess it was okay. Mm-hmm. Cause you, I guess you get to see the real person, you know, cause you're there. All That's the what time. people say, yeah, right? Yeah. 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 You get to see the, you know, real person versus, you know, visiting or whatever. Um, now are you asking, do I, do I still, are you down with it now? Yeah. yeah. Are you down with it now in this current, uh, say you and your friend mm-hmm. and, Y'all might want to say we're taking it to the next level. Okay, mm-hmm. well, come in and move in. You don't have to pay for your house or apartment. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, so what would you feel? Well, 
I, I would think like, I would think about it because it, that's a hard thing to think about because remember, like I said, I didn't, I didn't have any guidance and I just did what I thought was right. You know, I know what's right. What's right is, you know, you got to do it the right way and, 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 you know, make that commitment and then, you know, move in and all that other stuff. Right. That's the right way. Um, I don't know if I can go out. Well, I, I don't know. Maybe I could, maybe I could, maybe I could go outside the, uh, you know, and, and, and make that, um, make that, well, make that same commitment or whatever, but it's done in a different way. I guess it's done in a mature way now, more so than where I was, uh, previously or whatever. So, um, you, I, I guess I'm looking at it differently. I'm do, looking at a different lens now. I'm not looking at the same way, you know, no, not at all. I'm, I'm here. Is that what I'm hearing? I'm hearing the growth in that. Yeah, yeah. And you're so willy-quick, right. but is that a yes or no? Did, was it a yes or no? Well, that's what I, said. I just said. Yeah, yes. I just said yeah. It was a yes. Okay, I was like, okay. That was, <laughs> yeah. that was about eight minutes, right? Oh, there, okay. My bad. That. I'd like to explain. That's my dog. Well, I didn't yeah. want to explain. But you know, I'm messing with you. <laughs> uh, I don't agree with it. So uh-huh. That's just me. He's like, nah, forget it. Nah, Mm-mm. no, not me. I mean, I did, you know, but you made me think though. Back in the day, I was young, you know, sailor, get off the boat. And I used to say, man, I don't stay with that that lady or whatever. Mm-hmm. Because, you know, I had to have duty days on the ship, you know, but most of my clothes was over there, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, but so I've done it before or whatever. But now at this stage, now I wouldn't want to, I wouldn't want to just live with a, a lady unless I was making that commitment and we about to get married or something like that, mm-hmm. you know. That's what I. That's what I. That's what I'll say. So it was good to get your perspective on it, man, and everything. But okay, okay, all right. ready. And I'm, I'm curious in what how other people think about this. You know, yeah. in the comments, man. Put Please. put yeah. put in the comments. Like, what do y'all think about um, moving in? What do you think about long distance relationships? Do they work? Does it matter your age? If you're in a different age bracket, maybe you're a little more mature, and then you can make it work. Versus if you're younger, you just kind of like. Flopping the wind, I don't know, but I'm, I'm curious. Uh, place it down in the comments. Let us know. Let 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 the Crimson Brothers know for sure. That's, yes, <laughs> that's the uncomfortable truth. Hey, hey, Roger that. Let's go. You know, if you don't want to see us, but you want to just listen to us, we on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Amazon, Pandora, iHeartRadio, Google Podcasts, all of them, all of them. 